Hi, my name is Jo and I'm here today with a shoe haul. These are shoes that I brought over the past, I want to say from February till kind of now. Um, Colby's just bringing them in, <laughs> dumping them on the floor. I actually filmed this part of the video already and it was just not good quality. So I've come home from work. It is 4.30 and I'm going to quickly try and film this part now. So I look a little bit like bad raggled messy <laughs> and i'm a little tired but we're gonna keep going so anyway if you want to see my thrifted i don't know if i said that my thrifted shoe haul then please keep on watching Colby and I actually filmed the try-on portion yesterday because there's a couple of shoes that are his. So that footage was fine. Uh, so what you, what you might notice is that it's a nice sunny day today and that yesterday I mentioned that it was raining and that you might hear the rain. So it is a different day. All right, Colby, give me one pair. Which pair should we start with? Should we do the winter boots? Yeah, there's one, three, one. So we'll start with the winter item, which I actually brought not that long ago. I do usually buy my like new winter boots at the end of the year in the sale. And um, these were from Fred Up. I believe I paid $24.99 and they were brand new. I actually got to wear them once because we've had a very, very, very cold like spring so far. Although today is in the 80s and lovely. So these have a zip. They're not leather, but they are fleece lined. And I brought these really for practical reasons uh, for work. I need a flat shoe, I need a comfortable shoe, I need a shoe I can kind of get up and down from the floor in. So these are those. Very sun side. You wanna feel it? It definitely sounds. It's very soft. They actually are not as comfortable as they look. I feel like I need to wear them in. My um, bridge part was hurting, but yep, those are those shoes. And uh, yeah, I probably say they're comfortable in the video because when I tried them on, they were comfortable and I forgot that, because I haven't worn them for a while, that when I wore them, they did hurt a little bit after a while. But again, I wore them all day at work. So that, that's not unusual. Anyway, there's the first pair. <laughs> Copy out of the way. Yeah. Okay. Very, very comfortable. You don't come. Out of the way. Huh. Very comfortable. Perfect. Next up, we have some Born uh, sandals. I'm a big Born fan. I'm a Born fan and I'm a fan of Bulk, which is Born a Concept. I believe they are the same company. I think Born is the more expensive version and Bulk is the more affordable. I like both. Uh, but these are the those shoes. Now they, you can see the, uh, the footprint here, but in actual person, it doesn't show like it does on the camera. I don't know why it shows up so much. These are leather and they look slightly worn. I paid, I believe, $22.99 for these. And I love the height and the, the they're extremely light shoes. And I haven't been able to wear them. I guess I could have worn them today because it was nice enough, but I actually just wore my, my flats because, you know, wear flats when I can. I wear flats when I can. Um, but I love these sandals and I will try to probably wear them this week. These shoes are so comfortable. I've actually got to tighten this strap. It's a little loose, but they are so, so comfortable. And I like them ever such a lot. As I think I've said that like over and over in this video. I love shoes, but these are super comfortable and hopefully I can wear them sooner rather than later. Up next, we have a pair of Colby shoes. These are little Adidas slides. Here. Yes, you are there. Um, these were new. He's only really worn them around the house. They look a little scuffed on there, but in reality, they don't look too bad. I guess there's some mud, so they must have gone outside at some point. I brought these for $13.99 because his dad has the same pair. So when I saw these, I, you know, I wanted to get matching ones. Uh, these are also from, all these shoes are from Fred Up, so I'm not going to keep saying that, but they are, they were... A very good deal and i love the fact that he can do matchy matchy with his dad okay stand still stand back a little bit okay turn around slowly 
slowly, slowly. Turn around again. Are they comfy? Yeah. Are they good? Yeah. Thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> These are my bulk sandals. Again, they are super duper light. Kobe, nope, it's just dumping his Lego out. Oh, did you have to pick the loudest toy? Oh, I promise it was quiet when I filmed yesterday. And are we done? Okay, so here they are. They are leather, they are, everything's a size nine. I am terrible. That's what happens when I film after work. But everything is a size nine, that is my size. I don't have particularly wide feet. I don't have particularly narrow feet, they're kind of average. I think my feet look wide, but I never need wide shoes. Anyway, here they are. And they're just really simple, really, really light. I love the design and the topo canal and the nice flat, fat heel. Uh, again, another pair of shoes I've not worn yet, and I can't wait to wear them. And I believe I paid about $19.99 for these. I really cannot explain how comfortable these shoes are. If you see these shoes anywhere, buy them. Because they are like, for a little hill, they are so, so comfortable. They just feel so good. The top part is lightweight, and my toes are not, they're not getting cut off. Ignore my toes, I do, they... They are not the nicest nails, but they are, they're mine. Um, but I love these shoes. They are just super duper, super duper comfortable, which is what I need at work and over the summer. Let's get into the Crocs. I have a few pairs of Crocs. The first pair are these Croc sandals. Now I love, Kobe, enough with the Lego love. Wait, Kobe, come sit with me, behind me. So it's a little quieter. Come sit behind me. Uh, these Crocs, and um, I brought these because I think Crocs are extremely spongy and comfortable. And this, I don't think, looks like a Croc. Like, it is a Croc, and, you know, it is. And when you put it on, your foot covers up the whole Croc part, and you tie it up. And it does up with this. It's a little different. I put my hands are in the way. It's like a, a hoop. And yeah, I just really like these. I wore these for picture day. They are pretty good. My little toes literally just fit in here. So they only just like work for me. And this is a little tight, not too tight. I know that if, if I wear it, it will feel a little bit better. They are not leather, but um, they are fabric. So I do think that they will get, that this part will get more comfortable. The heel part was amazingly comfortable. So this are, these are them that I've worn them, but I do not believe they were worn before I did. I literally wore them for school picture day and that was it. But I really like these. I believe I paid 20, yeah, 24 99 for these. So these shoes are really comfy. The only place where they're not particularly comfortable yet is the toe and you can see my toe is literally just, just in there. They also have this funky way of doing up, which is kind of neat. I'm not sure I'm doing it. Like, I'm not sure if it should be underneath or not, but it's like a, a hook. And then you grab. So I kind of like that. That's kind of neat. This one's a little loose. Uh, but there they are, the crook dressier shoes. Colby wants me to share his Crocs next. So I brought, Colby's a big fan of Crocs and I only really got into Crocs because my mum loves Crocs and uh, not the traditional Crocs, but like the um, other ones, like I like, like this kind, you know, she likes that and the, the, the flat ones. My son loves the traditional Croc, Croc clock and he has several pairs. So when I saw these on thread up for $18.99, I thought they looked a little more stylish, <laughs> a little less Croc-like and would be great for summer. So I brought him these. He has worn them quite a lot. They really, I think they had been worn, but they didn't look too bad. Um, but I thought they were really nice. I love the color. And, and they were being worn. They have been worn, that's what he said. They have been worn. And he is currently a size 13. Slow, 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 slow. Turn around, turn around, show me your shoes. Say, these are my Crocs. These are my Crocs. Right, put your foot down, stand, back a bit, back a bit. There, freeze. Turn, turn, turn. Slowly. No, nope, turn, turn. <laughs> All right, that'll do. I have one more pair of Crocs, and these are for me. 
Now, I'm not the biggest crop fan, but when I saw these, I was like, I, I kind of need them. And my son, as I said, loves Crocs, and I knew he would love me in them. And that is these Mickey Mouse Crocs. Now, I mentioned that we're going to England, but we're also going to, um, where are we going? To Disney, Disney World in Florida. We're and Lego World. And Lego World. We're actually going to, we're going to drive down to Florida. My mom and aunt are going to fly over from England. We're going to do a week in Florida, and then we're going to come back here, do a week here, and then we are flying back to England for three weeks. So I saw these, and I thought, you know what? By the pool, those would be pretty cool. And... Um, yeah, so I did buy these. They are a size nine and uh, they are covered in Mickey Mouse. And going to be honest, I do feel a bit silly in these, but <laughs> they are comfortable and they're very lightweight and they are Disney. So <laughs> and Colby adores them. Uh, so I'll put aside my feeling silly for that. Also, mostly these are for around the house. So I don't mind feeling too silly there. Or maybe walk into Dollar Tree up the road, which, you know, again, I thought fine and needs in Dollar Tree. I brought these Pumas because I had a need for a flat, kind of a navy shoe. I couldn't find a navy shoe, but this one was uh, blue, so it worked. They are, they are Pumas. They got the logo there. They're a little dirty because I have been wearing them. And I just really like them because they fulfilled a need I had. And they are really comfortable. When I first got them, the back bit here felt like it was going to rub. And I wasn't going to keep them. But I wore them around the house for just like half an hour. And it didn't hurt. So I wore them to work. And actually, it just kind of gave. I never got a blister. It just kind of gave. And now it's super duper comfortable. So I'm really happy with these. I'm really happy because, like I said, they actually fulfilled a need I had. And uh, I love rubber soled shoes at work as well. And I believe I paid, what did I pay for you? $22.99, something like that. It's just started raining and we're in the sunroom because the light's the best here. And I'm hoping that you can't hear the rain. There was a song, Jason Donovan covered it in England. I don't know if it was originally his. And it was, listen to the rhythm of the falling rain. And I sing it every single time it rains. I brought Colby a pair of Converse All-Stars. And these were, I believe, $21.99. And they're a size 13. Now, they're the same size as all his other shoes. But they're like half an inch longer. He can't wear them yet. They make him like slap his feet. But I loved the color combination. And they were brand new. You can see there's like nowhere at all. And I just, I thought they were great. I think we've done this, the scuff in here. Um, yeah, I'm very excited. I mean, look at the details in these. It says Converse All-Star on the, on the tongue. Really, I'm buying him the shoes that I wish I could buy for myself. Okay, so you can see these are, his toes are about here. So they are a little big, but they still look good back a little bit. All right, turn around. That was a little fast. They got little American flags on the back which is really cute turn around can you wear them yet no he's saying yes he's nodding his head no they're too big too big they look a little bit like clown shoes on you right now <laughs> actually they do look they are reminiscent of bowling shoes <laughs> i love jambu shoes and when i saw these jaboo by jambu sandals i thought i've got to get them these are near enough an exact copy of a pair i used to have that I wore it until they broke. Like they just, I think they snapped here. Like you couldn't save them. They are vegan leather, which is just another way of saying pleather. They are memory foam and they are rubber all around. They're just very sturdy. I love them because you can wear them for like long walks. You can wear them at work. You can wear them with a dress. You can wear them with pants. Like they're really versatile. And I paid $16.99. Kobe also wanted to show you his original green crocs that i mentioned so here's our his other pair i don't know that <laughs> there you go stand next to me next to me go no next to me put your leg down put the leg down say ta-da ta -da! Oh, okay one more one well that's all the shoes all of them i hope you enjoyed this video that's all the shoes i have to share i'm sure i'll buy more
Comment another video. Anyway, comment. So what do we say? Leave a nice kind comment down below. Yeah. What else do we say? Um. Bye. And we say. See you later. Sub subscribe. So we See say, you later. Please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Kind comment below. Thumbs up, and we'll catch you in another video. Bye. Bye. Mm. Mm.